All right, what it do, y'all? Time to hop in mode. I don't know what's going on with TikTok, but it won't let me use my own custom sounds anymore. It is what it is, though, because first of all, I make these videos to get God's word across, not my word or anything. And I have no problem using other sounds that, you know, I feel that is right. But first of all, we're going to talk about Adam and Eve because, you know, a lot of people, including myself, I have made a video about Adam and Eve judging them off their mistakes and things like that not knowing that i'm the same human as them that's why they are the beginning of time and things like that but this is what we're going to talk about because a lot of people make judgmental videos about how adam made his decision and how eve made their decision and how they decisions is based on the life they live right now when it's not true because you literally get to choose on what you get to do just like they had a choice of eating the fruit right so this is what we're going to talk about Adam chose this woman for a reason. Eve chose the fruit for a reason. Not saying that it was right to choose the fruit or uh, Adam choosing Eve over God, but this was the thing that we got to think about, that there are human. It's a lot of people that say, you know, if I was in Adam's shoes, I would have chose God or anything like that. But you don't know how long Adam been with Eve, how God made Eve for Adam or anything like that, because you got to think Eve was the perfect first, the perfect first woman for Adam. This was the first woman, the, the only woman that he had in life, and he still chose over uh Eve over God. But this is the thing though. Why? Why did he choose Eve over God? When it comes to that, let's think about this. What is a woman's role that God made for Eve? I mean, Adam. Because he said, no man is meant to be alone. So, it had to be something that was going on in Adam's mind for him to go and eat the fruit and be like, I still choose Eve over God. I still choose this creation over the creator. Not saying that it's right again. But us being human, we think that these carnality things are better than God, even though he gave it to us. Because... God could have gave another Eve to Adam, a more perfect Eve. God could have started over with everything, but God sees everything. He's all norm, right? So regardless if he made a, another Adam or anything, he was still going to make the same mistake. But why though? Why is he making the same mistake? Because Adam thought she was uh, nourishing. She thought he was, she was caring. He thought she was the best woman alive, that there's nothing more perfect than her. Because that's the way God made her. She was already perfect. But she chose her own desires just like the devil chose his own desires, his own pride, his own sin over God because he wanted to be more beautiful. He wanted to have everything. He wanted to have everything more than everything. And it doesn't even make sense, right? But why would you want more everything over everything? Because we live in a carnal mind. Adam was living in the flesh. God gave him this beautiful creation. And he's like, oh. I don't want another one. You already made her perfect in my eyes. He was thinking of himself. And that's the thing that we do. We think of ourselves in today's life. And we think, we thought about ourselves in the past life. And we're going to think about ourselves in the future life. It even says that people will deny God. Even if the devil, even when the devil is gone. Even when we're in heaven. People will still try to deny God. Why is that though? It's because we live in a body and the flesh. And we think everything that we have now in today's life is better than what God is. And God is everything. But why would he choose Eve over God? Because she was perfect. You see how powerful God is? He made something perfect for us. And we choose to choose. Like we choose to go gluttonize over it over the creation over everything this is what i was talking about last video because we love the creation more than the creator when we're not supposed to do that god could have easily gave him another eve he didn't even know eve was coming he, he eve came while he was asleep he didn't even know eve was coming and he still chose that creation because he like what else is there you gave me the perfect woman and she literally was perfect but it's always about the wrong decisions that we make. So this is the thing. You are perfect. But you have imperfections. You know what comes from imperfections? Your decisions. Your decisions make those imperfections. 
So this is all about making better decisions for your future, whether you think it's right or wrong. You gotta choose what's right. And in order for you to know what's right, build that relationship with God. Peace and blessings.